It has officially been four days since I've been locked out of my account, and yesterday was the day I hacked Demon's account. So, I think I'm going to continue to keep using Demon's account, but in this video, we are going to be making a tier list on every single fighting style in Bloxford. And luckily for me, even though I stole Demon's account, he still has every single fighting style, so we're going to go over them and rank them. Since I have this Bozo's account, let me go ahead and roll a fruit and see his luck. Do I trade it to my main account when I get it back, or does he get to keep it? Let's see. Oh! We got a dark fruit. You know what, Demon? Just because I'm nice, I'll let you have it. And on my screen, I have the tier list. As you can see, we have every single fighting style except for the first fighting style, which is known as combat. That's not on this list because as soon as you switch your fighting style, you lose it forever. Since combat's not on here, I'm just going to already throw it into hot trash. You can't really see it. I can't do anything about that. But combat is hot trash. It's the first one you start with. But next up, we have is Electro Claw. And I'm going to tell you guys, this claw is amazing. I'm just going to start off by saying it has like one of the best like abilities in the game for such an easy fighting style to get it does a decent amount of damage you have a lot of cool abilities like you hold z it does that you press x it does this and if you press c you have like a slam down ability that can dash pretty far and it looks really good it's honestly a pretty solid fighting style so i'm gonna kick off this tier list by giving electric claw the position it deserves i'm gonna have to go ahead and move electric claw straight to god tier i think electric claw is the perfect fighting style to get if you don't have god human and all these other crazy fighting styles already. I almost forgot to mention, the reason why Electric Claw is so good is because you have crazy combo potential with this as well. You could combo your friends, your enemies, Rectway's mom, pretty much anybody with this. The next fighting style we have is Dragon Talon, or Talon. I don't know how you pronounce it right. Talon or Talon? But regardless, this is an interesting fighting style. I am not a Dragon Talon enthusiast, but a lot of people I know actually are. And I'm not gonna lie, it looks really cool. You have like fiery fists, like how does this not look cool? I didn't even realize this, but Demon has Dragon Talon Mastery 600. Bro, you need to go touch grass. I don't know what you're doing, but you need to stop. You see this demon right outside of Mansion? This is called grass. Go ahead and touch it, bud. Anyways, let's go ahead and test out its damage right over here. Let's see some damage. Oh my gosh, wait. This thing gives a lot of damage. So 18k damage just by doing like, I think, two full sets of swings. First ability we have is the Z ability, and that's called Talon Lighter. That's some good crowd control. That is really good. Next is the X ability. What does this do? I'm pretty sure they take burn damage as well, does he? Yeah, he does. Look at that. Taking burn damage down there. And the next thing we have is the Infernal Vortex or the C ability. Oh my gosh, that looks really good. This is honestly a really good fighting style. I'm not gonna lie. And if I'm not mistaken, it's the evolved version other dragon fighting style as well. Same thing with Electric Claw. It's the evolved version of Electric. But let's go ahead and see where this falls on the tier chart. Dragon Talon was pretty good, but personally, I don't know how to do any combos with them. Some people really enjoy Dragon Talon. So for me, it is not exactly god tier. But it is still really good, so I'm gonna have to put it at great. The next fighting style we have is Superhuman, and Demon has it mastery 419. It looks like he's one number off of the right number. Before I give this a rating, I have to put it to the right number. Hold on. I got you, Demon. Don't worry. And there we go, mastery 420. Anyways, let's go ahead and test out the Z ability called Beast Owl Pound. Okay, that's pretty good. It does have some good damage. It does stun them for a good amount of time. Oh, the second ability. This reminds me of the good times I had with Rex. Never mind, never mind. I shouldn't bring that up. It's called Thunderclap. And I'm gonna Thunderclap this NPC. Ooh, 3.7k damage. Next up we have is Conqueror Gun, which is the C ability. And that has some CC as well. It stuns him for a second. But it is pretty close to another fighting style that I know of as well. It's honestly pretty good. It has very good PvP potential. But with that being said, let's go ahead and throw this on the tier chart. So I do like Superhuman and its Thunderclap abilities for reasons I cannot discuss. But I will have to say, it's between God tier and Great. I am going to say it's just honestly a great fighting style, not God tier, because there is one better than this. This fighting style is called Sharkman Karate. And Demon has it Mastery 401, which isn't too bad. But this fighting stance is a little weird. I don't think I've seen a fighting stance like this before. But we gotta do some tests with this fighting style. We gotta see how much damage it does. The damage is honestly alright. It has very fast attack speed, but it does have knockback. So it kind of like pushes them away from you. So it's alright, I guess. But now we have to test the abilities. The abilities, first one we have is a Z ability called 12 Water Palms. And this does what? 
Honestly, that was super underwhelming. Next we have is Pressure Vortex. Okay, that one's pretty interesting. That one's not bad. Great Sea Spear. Oh, okay. The cooldowns are pretty fast, but it is nothing super impressive. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, you get this fighting style in the second C as well. So it isn't super overpowered as much as you'd like to think it is. Okay, yeah, the abilities aren't that impressive. So I'm gonna have to say, let's go ahead and see where this belongs. From my take on it, it's honestly not that bad, but it is nothing great or god tier. So it's gonna have to go straight into the mid tier next up is death step i think you guys already know where this is gonna go even though it pains me to say it i love my boy simp sanji and i think it's really cool that he uses his feet to fight because he saves his hand for cooking only it's just this is very underwhelming the damage is definitely better from dark step but it still is nothing super super impressive if we use a z ability it's the rocket kick it does very little damage and it does send him flying we have that as well which is the x ability and then the drill is all right i guess but like it isn't that impressive the V ability is basically like a damage booster, a maximum overheat. So if we go ahead and activate it, our feet actually go on fire. If we go ahead and do this, it does fire damage. And I think it's really cool, but like I said, it's nothing amazing. As much as I love my boy Sanji, I'm sorry. This fighting style goes straight into the trash tier. I wish it was something better damage-wise or just something. It deserves some damage buff because it is falling behind. Now we have Water Kung Fu, which is another water fighting style. Kind of like Shark Man in a way. This is a fighting style you get in the first c and it's nothing impressive the damage is a little low the z ability is all right deadly shower is actually pretty cool next up we have is heavy water punch that one's actually pretty nice but the damage isn't very like high up there just because it's a good fighting style to have in the first c i'm gonna go ahead and list it over here right into the mid tier it's not terrible but it's not that great either it goes straight into mid and now we have an air furry fighting style known as dragon breath now that we're done with the two sea furry fighting styles we've moved on to the air furry fighting styles which is the dragon one so let's go ahead and see what's up with dragon breath it's basically the downgrade of dragon talent if i'm not mistaken let's go ahead and see the damage on this bad boy it's it's all right honestly it's a second c fighting style you get wait what just happened did i lag or did it shoot twice that was the z ability called dragon rush let me see that again the z ability does this Oh no, it hits him with both fists. Okay, next up we have is Dragon Flames, and that's all right. Honestly, it's nothing impressive. That's okay. It's honestly just a mid fighting style overall. I'm not very impressed with Dragon Breath. To be honest, I would be dealing more damage if I were to be Dragon these n But with that being said, I'm gonna have to go ahead and put the Dragon thing down by like, I don't know, either mid or hot trash. I'm gonna have to say it's pretty hot trash. Next up we have is Dark Step. And I just hate how they did my boy Sanji dirty in this. He has one of the coolest fighting styles in my opinion. He just uses his feet because like I said, his lore is so sick. We go ahead and do any damage to any npcs it is not impressive at all these numbers are bad and the abilities are even worse like look at this if i hold z it kind of tells me where i'm gonna land but like look at this bro are you kidding me next up we have his breakdance which is pretty cool i guess but it's not really that cool and next we have his barrage it is really not that good at all look at the npc has some crowd control too and stuns me for a second. And the cooldown on the V ability is atrocious. Like, look it. I just equipped it, and I haven't used it yet, but it's still cooling down. But if we go ahead and activate the overheat ability, he spins around and gets fire on his feet. And of course, it's like a slight little damage buff. Throws fire around or whatever. But like, it is just not that impressive at all. But this goes where you guys think it's gonna go. Straight into the hot dog water tier. This doesn't even deserve to be called hot trash. That's like a compliment to these fighting styles. You know what? I'm gonna rename this to hot hot dog water this is hot dog water tier okay guys next up we have electric is basically like the first version of electro claw or electric claw i keep saying electro claw i don't know why and by the first glance it looks cool you have electric hands the sound effects is pretty nice and the damage is actually not that bad as you can see it deals a good amount of damage just by punching so it's definitely a good option for like i think it's a first c fighting style but we have stomp ability here and it's not that impressive but it is a first c fighting style then we have that little X ability, and the C ability is probably the best of all. It just stuns them there and deals damage, which is pretty nice. This is a first C fighting style, and if this is one of the fighting styles you can get in the first C, I would highly recommend it out of all the other ones. Electric is honestly great for first C, but not that crazy for the rest of the game. If you're grinding and you're just starting off and this is like one of the first fighting styles you can get, it would be great. Last but not least, one I am excited to talk about. 
is god human and god human oh my gosh demon has this mastery 593 demon what did i just say about touching grass i get that you don't have the other fighting styles leveled up because it's not as impressive as this one but bro look at this beautiful landscape demon go ahead and enjoy it but we have god human which is my personal favorite fighting style and i'm sure a lot of other people agree it has great abilities like look at the effects look cool. The damage is crazy. For the X and C ability, it's actually two in one. If you didn't know, the X ability can either be held to do that thunder clap that I did to Rexway's mom not too long ago. And it also has another one if you tap it. So let's go ahead and wait for the cooldown and I'm going to show you the tap ability for the X ability. We tap X. It shoots a little like ball thingy that deals damage. And next up is C ability. Use the C ability on this guy. You can hold it and it will charge up and go... Do that animation and go a lot further as well. Let me show you the C ability if I just tap it real quick. It just does it really quick. It doesn't do the animation for that long like how it did when I held it. And also the distances you fly is significantly different. Let me show you guys. This is how far you go if you tap the C ability. Not very far, right? If we hold it, it's fully charged. Look at how far this goes. That is significantly different. But with that being said, I think you guys all know where God Human is going to go. And that goes straight to God tier. And that is my tier list, guys. We have Electric Claw, we have God Human, we have Dragon Talon. But if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys want to see more like it, go ahead and leave a like and sub and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.